Yeah. Back, back with another, another one, man. You already know what it is, man. Hey. We got so back, look like in 2013 on the woke station, which I call CNN now. Woke. Ben Carson says white liberals are waste. I, I was that wastes a wastes a racist. Ben Carson says white liberals are racist. All right, let's hear. Let's hear. Aaron Burnett out front, weeknights at 7, only on CNN. Racist comments or politics as usual. So Dr. Ben Carson, you may be familiar with him, he's an up-and-coming African-American in the Republican Party. Anyway, he's being taken to tax, task tonight after making some controversial comments on Mark Levin's conservative radio show. Here it is. You're attacked also in many respects because of your race, because you're not supposed to think like this and talk like this. A lot of white liberals just don't like it, do they? Well, I, you know, they're the most racist people there are because, Ooh. you know, they put you in a little category, a little box. You have to think this way. How could you dare come off the plantation? Ooh. How could you dare come off the plantation? Carson and Levin were talking about how Carson says white liberals are attacking him for opposing gay marriage. Out front tonight, Mary Curtis, a blogger for The Washington Post, and Niger Innes, the chief strategist for the TeaParty.net. Okay, great to see both of you. Appreciate it. Um, Nigel, let me start with you. Does Dr. Carson have a point that white liberals tend to put African Americans in a certain category or a little box and that they are, as he says, quote, the most racist people? Well, yes, he does. He absolutely has a point. And, you know, look, Dr. Carson is not a refined uh, politician. He's a rank-and-file person outside of the field of politics. That's why the American people love him so much. So he can be a little clumsy sometimes with what he wants to say, but he's dead on with what he's trying to say. I mean, isn't it interesting, Aaron, I think even Mary would, would agree with me, that it is quite racist to say that all certain type of people look alike. But somehow, with many white liberals, and for that matter, black liberals, it is not racist to have the presumption that all blacks do or all blacks should think alike. And that's what Dr. Carson was talking about, and he's dead on. All right, let me, let me ask you, Mary, to be clear, what sparked this conversation about white liberals was what Dr. Carson recently said about gay marriage. So let me just play that to give everyone the context. No group. Uh, be they gays, be they NAMLA, uh, be they people who believe in bestiality, it, it doesn't matter what they are, they don't get to change the definition. Talking obviously the definition of marriage. Mary, if white liberals have an issue with what he just said there about uh, gay marriage, are they racist? Listen, this is politics. He's going to criticize others and he's going to get criticized. If you put same-sex marriage and NAMBLA in the same sentence, you will be criticized. And what did he do? He apologized. And it was time to move on. NAMBLA, by the way, sorry to interrupt. <laughs> he said, same-sex marriage, NAMBLA, bestiality. <laughs> what, is, what is NAMBLA? I'm what is, like, what is NAMBLA? I'm sorry. I, I thought that was so funny. I was try, I'm trying to bust out laughing because it, it's, it's, it's interesting. But, I mean, I can understand how they could be, they could be offended. And I understand and respect what he was saying, too, but I understand how how you put it together and can make it offensive. <laughs> I'm sorry. No. NAMLA, uh, you know, radio, um, car bombs, um, dirty socks. <laughs> he took some fun stuff in the box, boy. But uh, let me go. It's North American yes. Man Boy Love Association. That's why it's offensive. Yeah. <laughs> It is offensive. And as Niger said, he's not sophisticated. He's not used to politics. It's time to move on. But what did he do? He talked about white liberals and being racist, and he blamed them. And so he wants to be treated as an individual, and yet he stereotypes all white liberals as being racist. I didn't realize that in the end. I'm like, darn, that was fast. That was real quick. Well, I believe that... I ain't going to say the word racist. I feel like I don't like, I just don't like the word, but I feel like. I don't think this is enough information for me to be able to even truly what? understand. I mean, she well, not to understand, but to comment on. It's enough. It's a three minute right. clip to make comments. Yeah. And enough for me to say, even though 
what I heard, I didn't get that um, it would be all liberals. You know, I, yeah. I really would like to have a little bit more of the backstory, but something led him to make that statement. Where did he get that from? I believe what he's saying is pretty much them, those, that's who's pushing narratives. Okay. That's why he's using the word calling racist because I feel like white liberals kind of push the narrative, whatever the, whatever just, I'm going to say, I'm, I'm trying to say, I'm trying to say it a certain way. Um, not speaking against per se, but whatever goes in a place that we don't feel, we don't necessarily agree with, that's probably who's pushing certain things. Okay. And then he says, as soon as you say something that, they want to, they're going to attack you. So he's called, okay. he's so using the word racist, say but something against what like, they're saying. Again, okay. yeah. I, I, I know that's what you said, but I was also just saying in regards to the other part. But yeah, so I don't know what I guess he's saying racist. And people say hey, racist. He said, "Well, y'all racist because you're doing." I'm gonna say prejudice, but um, yeah, yeah. not pre, not appreciating his viewpoint and wanting to, you know to him wanting. That's that woke. Not stuff. wanting yeah. him to speak against pretty mm-hmm. much. That's yeah. that woke stuff. I get that. Okay. That's that's the woke opinion. Yeah, you know, we don't agree with whatever that's being pushed. Then you are demonized. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So. Actually, so that was good, man. That was this is an old clip, man. It's 2013. Ben Carson says white liberals are racist. Um, I wonder what Ben Carson's standpoint is now because I haven't heard from Ben in a long time. I ain't seen what he was talking about right. lately. But, um, yeah. Okay. All right. Like, comment, subscribe, man. Don't take a nose dive, but then comment in the section below, man. If you want some more, let us know. Let us know. Mm-hmm.